welcome back to the channel i'm here with wandering gypsy she literally lives out of her jeep that's her over there anyway this is pretty cool that she's having a meetup out here in courtside check her out i'm gonna wait until she gets a chat with all her subscribers and then we're gonna do a little mini interview with her to just kind of chat with her and but this is what she lives out of. She has a great story, you guys. Go check her out at Wandering Gypsy if you haven't already on YouTube. There's her channel right there. What is she doing? She's not calling anybody. Oh. This is a smaller Jackery that I have right here. And this is the 500 watt one. So I do have a 1500 watt Jackery, which is over here. Um, I recently just, this is a dual zone fridge and I was just using it as a refrigerator but I had to change her diet because she's getting older so now the spoiled little thing right here gets chicken <laughs> so I have to freeze the chicken now so one side is uh one side is a freezer the other side is a fridge so meaning it's growing more power now um so I'm actually on Monday getting solar installed on top of my chicken so Be just in the way. Um, you know what? So I had the fender deletes on because of my rock crawling days. Yeah, yeah. But like we're supposed to get rain over the next couple of days, and I'm obviously staying off of the dirt road. So meaning, I hear it's only light. The mud's right gonna kick all up on my Jeep now. Right. So I'm probably gonna be getting fenders. Mm. I'm kind of tired of the mud kicking up. Not much of a bother. Huh? And then there's no car wash here in Quartzsite. Oh, there isn't? <laughs> <laughs> it eventually falls off. What's that? It'll eventually fall off. Yeah. Five gallons for a dollar, though. Yeah. It is a Jeep, so. <laughs> mm -hmm. I've never washed my Jeep. Did everybody get stickers and fill your names out for the giveaways? Oh, Sarah. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, hi. Check it out, guys. This is the inside of her. Living quarters. She lives right out of her Jeep. That's tight but doable. Look here. She's trying to... Oh, she wants attention. Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. I'm here with Wandering Gypsy. We're going to do a little interview of her Jeep and she's going to show us um, her living situation and how she does it being in the Jeep. And this is the little one. This is the little one. She's the so real cute. star. Yeah, <laughs> adorable. So let's go check it out. So this is it, guys. This is the back of her Jeep. Look at her canopy. That actually unzips, or you can, it turns into a tent, right? Yeah, so I have a wall that goes around it and it zips in, and then it's like a tent enclosed around the Jeep. <laughs> so that's and great and then uh this is my home and i do do this full time so uh, i've been traveling around exploring nature for a little over two years and i chose to do it inside of my jeep it's <laughs> awesome my jeep will get me anywhere i want to go yeah and so this is my comfortable bed right here i have a refrigerator this is one of my jackeries which is for my power and everything and then I have my drawers, I slide out. That's pretty and good, good idea. This is where all the magic happens right here, cooking. <laughs> <laughs> so this is where I cook and make my coffee every single day. And then I have, this is my, my trash bag, that's on my tire. Yeah, I wanna get one of those, it's yeah, pretty handy. Yeah, this is handy because you go and camp in a lot of places, like free camping, there's not dumpsters or anything like that. So pack it in, pack it out. Yes, <laughs> please, people. <laughs> and then this is my big jackery down here that keeps my fridge plugged in. Uh, oh, that keeps my fridge running. How big is that? Uh, this is a 1500 watt jackery. Wow. And then because I do live in my Jeep, 
everything that I own is inside this Jeep. I don't want to have to get storage rooms and all that stuff. So I have an all season sleeping bag and this has multiple layers in it and I can take the layers out and it can go into a summertime sleeping bag or put the layers back in and it can go into a winter sleeping bag. This is very handy by the way, it's a sleeping bag. Nice. Very handy. So yeah, this is my, my little home that I, I live inside I love it. Of. So. Well, thanks so much for the quick little show of your uh, your home. I love it. Of course. And thanks for the meetup. Yes. And it, it was great, great meeting you. Thank you. <laughs> and if you're not subscribed to her channel, subscribe to her channel. She has a good little channel. She does a lot of traveling like me. So subscribe. And you guys need to go find her too. She's wandering gypsy. Where's Oops, your... Sorry. <laughs> Here's her. Her name, go find her on YouTube. She's awesome. <laughs> go check her out, guys. She has a great story and great adventures. <laughs>first of all i hope you enjoyed that footage it was the best footage i could get while i was hanging out at wandering gypsies meetup i wanted to really thank all my new subscribers out there that i've gotten since i've been here in quartzite i have about a week or so to go while i'm here and then i'm gonna move on thank you for all of you who have been watching and supporting my channel I really appreciate you and for those of you that are still watching and haven't subscribed please hit the subscribe button and give me a thumbs up and comment on my videos it would really help out my channel today I'm just kind of taking it easy last night when I came back to camp um, I went and ran errands you know did the usual RV thing had to get more water dumped the tanks um, got some more supplies, did laundry, all that good stuff. Um, I wanted to get all that out of the way before the rains come tonight, if it does. But anyway, I don't want to be traveling through some of these washes uh, if they get muddy. So I'm staying put for a few days, let the storm pass. Um, so when I came back to camp, I went to a different location um, thinking it would be better and it was awful so I got no sleep last night it was actually noisy I could hear the highway a lot louder than normal so yeah it's amazing how just moving a couple of feet can make such a difference but I heard the highway noise all night I got no sleep and that's not normally like me like me normally I can sleep through anything but I don't know, last night was strange. So anyway, I moved back to my regular spot today and I'm really tired. Today I'm just kind of lounging around, especially with the weather getting ugly. Um, it's warm, but it's gloomy outside. So that's really strange. We'll see if we get any rain tonight. I mean, I know we need it. Thanks again for watching. Please remember to hit the subscribe button if you haven't already subscribed to my channel and give me a thumbs up and I'll see you in the next video. Take care.